while in person stage productions did take a nap during the pandemic. One high school musical class sure did wake up the audience during their comeback presentation of Once Upon a Mattress. Once upon a pandemic, students from Baldwin High School had dreams of performing again. Concerts were canceled, leaving them really missing the stage. It was devastating. We were so close to getting to perform. Um, I think we were about three weeks out and everything got canceled and shut down. But tonight. Before a spread out audience, Donning donated clear face masks as part of their colorful medieval costumes. The lights are burning once more for the student production of Once Upon a Mattress, their first performance in over a year. It's a musical version of The Princess and the Pea, but it's The Princess and the Pea kind of by way of the Cohen brothers. Um, there's a very talkative queen and a mute king, and they have a, a son who's 36 years old and has not been married. And uh, they interview 12 girls, and the 13th girl literally sw swims the moat, climbs the castle wall, and um, she becomes... Prince Dauntless's bride. The cast has been rehearsing since January under extreme COVID aware conditions with temperature checks before and masking during rehearsal. Challenging, but a storybook ending for seniors like Allison Dalmas who get to have their final bow. I'm excited for audience members to be transported into a completely different time, like point in time. And just for them to be able to watch a show and sit in the audience with their family and laugh and cry and just feel all the feels about what they're watching. Loving that hair on point, makeup on point, costumes on point, everything. I'm here for it. Listen, two students are nominated for Gene Kelly Awards for their respective roles. The show runs through May 1st. Tickets are 12 bucks. For more information, check out KDKA.com.